So a nice shot there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave where they're supposed to be. And if you do that, most times you will block the shot that's incoming. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body hit. Right punches there. He has a commitment to kicking tonight, and it shows. Right hook to the body. And they separate. Big shots being landed on both sides here. All right, single collar tie now. Very nice leg kick there by Shore. So one minute into this fight, and as many people expected, the action absolutely crazy. Back and forth with some full-on brawls. It's hard to watch a fight like this and call a fight like this because you never know when somebody's going to take that one shot that finishes the fight. Joy gets caught with that punch. You wonder if the offensive fighter is going to start to get frustrated here. Most skipped on all these shots are getting blocked. They're getting blocked because he's fighting one of the best defensive fighters in the UFC. Looks like he clipped him with a left hand counter there. Just over three minutes to go. Look at the turtle in that kick. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Oh, lands a stiff punch there. Nice connection. Oh, nice land. Tags him with a flush left. Checks that leg kick. Ooh, head kick lands. He's hurt. Almost in range with the straight left, but that's a miss. And both guys really throwing with authority. All right, he engages in the single collar ties. Ooh, what a punch. Oh, perfect timing on the Superman punch. Roundhouse kick, and it lands. It lands, and even if you think you're blocking it, it really is still having an effect on your opponent. Oh, and there's another leg kick for good measure, so doing a really good job with that weapon here tonight, and if you're trying to slow your opponent down, you should accomplish so far. When you can land that many leg kicks, you start to affect the movement. You start to affect the hands. Everything changes when you're blasting someone over and over and over with leg kicks and you start to see the damage, not only in the leg, but in the facial expression right in the pole. And they separate. Well, he told you off the top he had the reach advantage, and you saw it right there with that punch. Nice punch lands over the top. Oh, nice check on the leg kick offering there. really put his opponent on the defensive here early. Very aggressive right out of the shoot. He has landed a high number of total strikes. Exactly the aggression you'd like to see given what is at stake here tonight. Ooh, 
what a punch. Beautiful head kick. Try to establish that jab. Oh, beautiful straight left hand. Well, he's certainly keeping busy, DC, connecting with most of the punches he's thrown. I mean, punches in bunches. He's doing a great job. Sound defense there as he blocks the shot. Five minutes in the books. Well, what a round it was, especially from a striking standpoint. DC, take us through. High-level striking. I mean, this is what people come through the doors to see. Two men stand on a quarter, chest to chest, forehead to forehead, and let it all fly. I'm surprised nobody went out, but it does excite me for the next round. All right, we'll see how it goes here in this next round. A high number of kicks landed there in the previous round, and at some point, these are going to really start to take effect. They do start to take an effect whenever you're taking kick after kick after kick. And watching him fight with that knowledge and that patience shows his fight IQ. There you go. Oh, yeah. Trying to establish that jab once again. All right, well, he's landed some good shots tonight, but there's no three-piece, there's no soda. More often than not, it's one and done. He's not even getting a combination. I mean, hey. if you're going to sit there at the drive-thru, oh, yeah. order a combination, take the soda with your food, give him the right hand behind the jab, give him the hook behind the right hand, jab, right hand, hook, that's two pieces of chicken and a biscuit, finish him off with uh -huh. the uppercut, that is your soda. I mean, come on, man, let this guy have the whole thing. Joy gets caught with that punch. Look at him working and trying to shut the liver down. Well, he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. He continues to connect on a high volume of strikes here. Got his shots pretty well here early, DC. He's doing a great job of mixing things up, keeping busy, being very accurate. Well, that left hand has been there at times, not on that attempt. Good punch. And they separate. Right hand upstairs. Over and over, he's landing these big body kicks. Right hook to the body. Head kick. Oh, nice straight punch there. Must be nice to have a reach advantage like this, DC. How's his opponent still stand? I mean, I have no idea. This fight is supposed to be over. And it might not be over now, but it's going to be over very soon. So a much different approach for him here in this second round. He was a little bit tentative in round one, a little bit of a feeling out process. Now he has clearly found his rhythm, found the range. We'll see if he can continue with more activity here in round two. And he landed the right hand there. Nice head kick. Big punch land. Ooh. What a tricky head kick. Right on the button. He blocks the punch. Big head kick. Big ball punch lands. Now we get back to range. Nice one through there. Straight right, he misses. Choi's hook shot blocked though by the defense. Nice job getting that guard up to prevent any further damage. Oh, nice job to slip off the center line there. His head movement has been a huge, huge factor defensively in this fight. You can never be a stationary target, so even if the feet aren't moving, you gotta be ready to slip that head at a moment's notice. Very tricky when he throws that body kick. Oh, he lands the Superman punch. How about it? Man, is he timing his shots well here tonight, DC. It's hard to recall him being this accurate in the past. I mean, he is so sharp. 
And not only is he accurate, he's also keeping very busy. Effective use of the jab there by Choi. I mean, he's cutting them down to size with these beautiful leg kicks. What a punch. Real sneaky head kick gets in there. Choi's kick to the body, that one's locked. 20 seconds to go round two. Now he counters with a right hook to the head. Oh, he has landed a high volume of strikes in this round. It really hasn't let up when it comes to his aggressiveness. The striking has been on point every step of the way. Careful to not gas out, but you gotta like the output here down the stretch. High-level striking action in that last round. Daniel, take us through it, if you will. Tit for tat. Who has the best chin? It seemed as though they were looking for that answer. Both guys took risk. What a fantastic round. All right, so after he landed a high number of Great kicks fight. in the previous round, we'll Great. see if he can keep it going here as our next round gets under. He should stay the course. He's so educated with his legs and his feet that he's given his opponent a very difficult time trying to anticipate what's coming his way. Liver kick, if you take those kicks, it's gonna shut your body off. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one up? Much improved defensively as he gets the shot. Well, most fighters can't keep up this type of aggression and pace, but you don't have to worry about this guy. He hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. Big kick lands. <laughs> Timely defense there. Huge block for him. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Goes upstairs for an elbow. Look at the angle of that nice body push. Joy gets caught with that punch. He's treading water now. Got to find a way to move those feet. Big leg kick land. Well, a lot of sting behind these kicks. Solid leg kicks here by Choi. Over the top. This fight's gonna be over, DC. What a great way of mixing up his attack. He didn't stay the course. He mixed it up. He went high when his opponent thought he was going low. And now he's got him hurt very badly. Look at how he turned his hip into that leg kick. Just over three minutes to go now. Oh, big punch land. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Watch the shot. Wow. All right, he closes the distance, gets the single collar tie. Both fighters hanging down in the pocket and both landing. Can't take many of those, you better check. Superman punch. Just missed with the straight left hand. Oh, he's got it going now. Nice connection there, DC. Another punch land. Look at the force behind that leg kick. Strong defense here as the hook to the head is blocked. Right hand on point. Pretty good right hand. Just missing on the uppercut there. 
Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to pile up these body shots here in the latter stages of this fight. You didn't see a lot of that in the earlier rounds, making up for lost time here. Beautiful strike. Big left hook coming, is blocked. Oh, spinning bad fist, he didn't telegraph that one at all. Looking to land the right hand, he misses. Oh, it looked like he was trying to set up the head kick, but he misses on that attempt. Oh, there. Well, that is exactly how you turn defense into offense. Catches the kick and dumps him on the mat. What a great job timing that kick, driving into his opponent and putting him on his back. to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Punch over the top. Head kick lands. Going. 20 seconds to go. Fifteen seconds. Oh, big left hand there. Just out of range with that right hook. That's three rounds in the can. We're headed to the championship rounds. All right, that horn marks the end of the round. There was a lot to like really on both sides, but particularly that Superman punch, an absolute thing of beauty. Beautiful attack. Her ability to let loose in the octagon is truly a sight to behold. Not many people are willing to try something so risky. All right, next round is underway, and if you look at these two guys in between rounds, it looks like they've barely broken a sweat, both with good resting heart rate, stamina still very high, and you just have to log the efforts of these guys in training. Both men certainly noted cardio specialists, but incredible that they would have this much in the tank after 10 plus minutes of fighting. He's looking for that left hand, not there. That's a big strike right there. Combination lands for him. He is really putting his strikes together tonight. I mean, he's feeling himself tonight, John. He's doing a great job of putting everything together. Oh, the kickboxing chops on full display with that offering nicely done. Beautiful kick landed by this man. Oh, nice. Oh, nice connection by him there with the right hand. The right hand is the dominant hand, and you can see how well he throws it. Way to hide that. That's one of those shots, but if you take one of them, if you end the night, that will land it right on the spot. Well, he has certainly kept the punch counters busy tonight. He's landed a ton of significant strikes and clearly is winning this fight tonight. He's winning this fight going away, and it's one of those rare instances where everything comes together. Oh, effective strike there by Shore. Man, look at the redness now almost immediately on the right side of his body. Ooh, blocks the shot. Oh, big head kick. Now near the body. What a beautiful uppercut. It landed beautifully. Perfect placement on that shot. He's giving him so many different things right now. Under three minutes now to go in the round. Good punch, Lance. Trying to hammer that lead leg. Big body kick, Lance. Punch coming, it's blocked. Oh, and he caught the kick. Rips the body. 
body there for good measure. Nice head kick. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Man, look at the redness starting to appear on the left side. Oh! Huge right hand! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Oh, beautifully timed with the Superman punch. That was a thudded leg kick. He ate that kick. He took that whole kick, yep. Hands up. Real nice body kick land. Lands a good series of kicks there, DC. It really didn't take him long to get a good beat on his opponent. Oh! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh, straight right! Working off of his back here. Looks like he may try to hip escape. Well, you gotta be working off of your back. He's certainly doing so here. Nice punch. Crazy accuracy and efficiency with these ground and pound strikes here. And if you're the opponent, you gotta intelligently defend or the referee's gonna stop. You gotta defend. But you can see him now starting to gain posture and the intensity at which he's throwing these ground strikes is starting to improve. It's starting to elevate because he knows that he can get the finish. 15 seconds remain in the round. Oh, he leads with a power right hand there, DC. That'll work. Really sat down with that right hand. Just misses there with the left. Now connects with the right. And there's the buzzer indicating the end of round four. All right, so he gets knocked down, but not out. Let's look back at some of the highlights, DC. A huge round on the other side. He had him hurt very bad. He found the shot. He got exactly what he wanted. When he saw the opening, he jumped on it, and he hurt his opponent very bad. If he can get back to that one more time, he may end the night. Misses with the jab there. Punch is blocked. Don't wait. You hit him first. Leg kick. Whoa! Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Back to the feet. Oh, big left. Staying busy off of his back. Nice offense from the bottom. Back to the feet now. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Good series of strikes for him there. Staying busy and staying accurate. I mean, the accuracy is unbelievable. Big punch lands through the middle. Oh, the Superman punch lands. Oh! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Here, but a nice job by the bottom fighter defensive. Bottom fighter did a fantastic job of following with his hips, making sure he blocked any attempt to get past his guard. Close guard. Just over three minutes now to go in the fight. Good movement by him here, transitioning very well on the ground side. Step for step, he's staying with his opponent in every transition.
Useful strike there, the ground and pound on point tonight. Two minutes now to go in the fight. All right, the referee not seeing enough action there. We go back to the center of the octagon now. Well, he put so much stock into this fight, and now we're late in the game, and if he doesn't get a finish, this opportunity goes by the board. I mean, it's almost over. Right now, he's got to start throwing everything he can. Oh! And just like that, the fight is over! Oh! What a performance! Just an absolutely gorgeous shot to spell the end for his opponent. Crowd is absolutely loving it. He gets the near-perfect land. I'm not even sure his opponent saw it coming, but just the way he drew it up here tonight, saw that little crack of an opening and barged right through it to get the knockout. And there he is after the huge knockout turned in tonight. Near-perfect execution and one of the bigger highlights of his UFC career. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at three minutes, 17 seconds of round number five. Playing the winner by knockout, the Korean Super Bowl, Du Ho Choi. All right, so there he is, the man of the hour. What a massive knockout for him.